Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Hey, today I just wanted to cover something real fast with you. I've been having trouble with my Wondershare and the problem is I've got a lot of videos, I mean hundreds of videos with music from Wondershare and uh, YouTube sent me a notification that there was copyright claims on my video so I went back and looked at them and uh, yeah, it was. I just used a little bit for intro and a little tiny bit for the exit of my video, and I got hit on that for a copyright claim. And I use Filmora, uh, Wondershare Filmora, and also let's see, I think mine is updated to 11. And I sent them a message, they didn't get back with me, so I sent them another message, they didn't get back with me. And so I just I just kept sending messages till finally they got back with me. But let me see. Hold on with me because this is important. If you're using Filmora or any other video editing equipment, and and uh, they're supplying you with audio files, I want you to just listen to what they had to say to me. Okay, after a couple of messages I sent to Wondershare Filmora, I finally sent another one that says, "Is anyone going to answer my question?" The song name is Secrets, and I just used a little bit at the beginning of the video and a little bit at the end of the video. I asked, can you help me? And I said, uh, from YouTube, this is a message from YouTube, a copyright owner using content ID has claimed some material in your video. It claims that the music file I used has a copyright claim. Okay? So, and I, I messaging uh, Wondershare from Mora, and I said, it's from the Wondershare audio file in from Mora video editor. Are they free to use or not? I need to know because YouTube is demonetizing my videos that have film Mora audio files in the videos. So this is one answer I got back. It's a as much as we appreciate you and your support, this is from Wondershare Filmora. As much as we appreciate you and your support, please don't post the same comment on every video or spam the comments. I didn't ask the same question on all of them, but it alluded to the same question because nobody was answering my question. So let me go back to the other one here because it had... It actually had a reply from them. So let me go back. This is another reply from Filmora. It says, this is pretty amazing because they they sent it, they they sold us Filmora, Wondershare Filmora, and it has audio files in it. It says, you can use them on your videos, but it says, we do not own the copyright to the music in Filmora 11. We do license it legitimately for a source and are authorized to give you a license to use it with your purchase of a license of Filmora 11. That, that's an oxymoron. I mean, it, either, it either is licensed that we use it or it's not licensed. I'm going to go on. It goes on just a little bit. As outlined in our user agreement, this music built into Filmora 11 is for personal use only <laughs> and cannot be monetized. This is different from music found on film stock, which can be monetized unless the download page specific it can't. What? So basically, none of the music in Filmora, Wondershare Filmora, is licensed to be used in your videos unless you're just going to watch the video yourself. Don't put it on YouTube, especially if you have a channel that is monetized or you're going to get hit with a copyright claim. Let's see. If you need more assistance on this question, feel free to reach out to our support team from the link below, which is support one, support dot, I'll put it in the link down below, support dot wondershare.com forward slash en forward slash contact so I, I 
I am shocked that I have hundreds and hundreds of videos that are going to get demonetized and get copyright claims on them, and I could possibly lose my YouTube channel for using music on the Wondershare Filmora uh, studio that I used to make my videos. So I guess what I will do is try to find a different video editing service uh, that has music that is licensed for us to use in our videos because this is not right. Why would they put music in there for you to edit videos and post on YouTube that's not that they cannot give us a license for to use the music? Why even put it in Filmora if they can't give us a license to use it? That don't make any sense. Hey, thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And hopefully I'll have another video for you soon. But there won't be no music until I find me another video editing software that I'm going to use. So, hey, you guys have a great day. Have an awesome day. And I'll talk to you later. <laughs>